guys, it's Izzy's Amazing Life. And real quick, if you hear anything in the background, that is my sister and her friend through the vent. I had them go downstairs for a little while just because I'm filming. But, um, let's get on with the video. I'm really excited for today because today I will be announcing the winner of the Ultimate Doll Photography Challenge Season 3. And also, a video will be up later on the Season for the Ultimate Doll Photography Challenge auditions and how you can enter. But this, that, I cannot talk, but that video should, should be up around noon. So stay tuned for the premiere of that video. But this week's theme was Famous Woman in History Week. I'm really excited for this theme. It was incredibly hard to judge this week. I know I say that all the time, but seriously, this week was the hardest week I've probably ever had to judge. Um, it's just a very, very hard week. We definitely talk to each other a lot about it, like, kind of like, going off each other's stuff and things like that. It was very hard to judge, but we did come up with a winner, and I am really excited to announce who won the Ultimate Doll Photography Challenge Season 3. And I did say that people could that the two finalists were allowed to submit a video explaining how they did their photo, but neither of them did, but that is perfectly fine because their photos were awesome and that wasn't being judged or anything. So let's get into the first photo. The first photo is from Caitlin and she did Jane Goodall. So Jane Goodall is a scientist who was basically I don't know, I think she was the first, yeah, but, like, at least one of the first scientists who started studying chimps and monkeys and stuff in the wild instead of in a lab, so I think that is an amazing thing. So, let's start with the good things about this photo. So, first, the photo is very bright. Caitlin's eyes are crazily bright. They're so bright, but they don't look unnatural. It's amazing. It looks like Caitlin is actually out in the wild because of the background. The photo is realistic. I love the color harmonization between Caitlin's eyes, clipboard, and shorts. I love how Caitlin is holding a chimp. I love that the shirt is homemade. Your doll looks like Jane Goodall. The clothes fit the scene. The hairstyle fits the scene. The hairstyle is cute. I like how Caitlin is looking straight at the camera. We can tell what Caitlin is doing, and I love the attention to detail. And I do not have anything, like, negative to say about this photo. So overall, this photo is very bright and beautiful. The next and final photo is from Meredith, and she did a Florence Nightingale. So this picture is like a picture of her in 1854 as a nurse, and she is a war nurse, and she is, like, saving wounded soldiers right now. So, once again, I think that is amazing. Let's start with the good things about this photo. So first, I like how the photo is in black and white to match the time. Meredith's outfit is beautiful. I love the homemade candle. Meredith stands out. I love how there is a wounded spider in the background. Spider? For some reason, I read my writing as spider. Can't even read my own writing. That's good. A wounded soldier in the background. I love the attention to detail. I like how Meredith is looking at the camera. Meredith's eyes are very bright, and the photo is realistic. I still can't believe I said wounded spider. Now for some things you could have done better and some advice. So first, your doll does not look like Florence Nightingale, which did not really take away from your photo. It's just something that maybe you might, might have wanted to choose someone who looked like your doll, but mm, that didn't really matter. Um, and then you can't, you can't tell... She is a nurse just by looking at her, and you can see Meredith's feet. You can't see Meredith's feet, so it kind of looks like she's floating. Um, yeah, to me, since there's just, like, darkness under her instead of her feet, it looks like she's floating. But overall, this photo is very cool. And I'm not sure if I said this yet, but overall, this photo is very cool. So, before I say who the winner is for the Ultimate Doll Photography Challenge Season 3... I am going to go through all of the photos from all of the weeks. So let's get started with that. So first is the five finalists.
Next is Sports Week. Festive week. Fantasy week. Finally, Famous Woman in History Week. So now that I have gone through all of those, it is time to announce the winner. So first to Caitlin. Um, this photo is really, really good. We don't really have anything to say about it. It is just really, really good. So... Keep it up. Great job. Maybe make your photos just a little more realistic next time. And to Meredith, we also really loved your photo and the attention to detail, the realisticness of it. But at the same time, um, we can't tell she's a nurse, and that is a big thing for it. And also her feet kind of look like she's floating. But the main thing was that we can't necessarily tell that she is a nurse by looking at her. So the winner of the Ultimate Doll Photography Challenge Season 3 is Caitlin! Woo! So Caitlin, you win. Great job. So I will leave Caitlin's channel linked in the description, Desi and Shy Shy Time. And amazing job. You just did amazing throughout this competition. You were one of the strongest competitors. And you were always near the top. I think you always got, like, first or second, so, yeah, you always just did really good in this competition, so, great job. And to Meredith, great job to you also. You also were one of the strongest competitors. You always got first or second, and you also just did amazing. You guys both did amazing. This is a very strong finale for sure, and just amazing job to both of you. I am so excited, and I hope you guys enter for the next season. I know that um, one of you already told me you can't, but that is completely fine. It is completely fine, especially since I already was told that a couple more people are going to enter, so yeah. But I cannot wait to have you back for season five. But yeah, I am really excited for season four. Remember to go check out the audition video, and yeah. Bye, guys, from Izzy's Amazing Life. Here are Meredith's past photos. This one is five finalists week. This one is sports week. Festive week. Fantasy week. And finally, famous woman in history week. These are Caitlin's past photos. This one is the five finalists week. This one is sports week. Festive week. Fantasy week. And finally, famous woman in history week.